Hi guys, so in this video I'll show you how to fix the battery draining issues introduced in the Android 7.1.1 update. The first issue I noticed with this update was that my volume button stopped working. So if you have the same problem, I already made a video showing how to fix them, which you can check out by clicking on the card here. Now as of a few days ago, my phone can't even get through a whole day without needing a recharge. I'm not a heavy user, so seeing this type of battery drain is really annoying. Another serious bug that was introduced are the random shutdowns due to low battery states. These shutdowns occur anywhere from 60% battery down to 0% battery, which makes the device unusable in my opinion. Now let's have a look at how we can fix these battery problems. Now there are a few things we can do to optimize the battery after the update. And I will go through some of these easy fixes at the end of the video. Sometimes a simple restart can resolve some software problems. So it's always worth trying that out before you move on to more drastic measures. What solved the problem for me is flushing the device cache. In order to do that, we have to restart our device into recovery mode. But don't worry, your data is safe. Just follow the steps outlined in this video. To restart into recovery mode, hold down the power button and volume down button at the same time. The same buttons you'd press to take a screenshot. If your volume buttons don't work, then fix them first by watching the linked video. The next step is to use the volume down key to select recovery mode from the menu. Then press your power button again to select that option. Your device will restart into recovery mode. Once you arrive at this screen, carefully hold down the power button and then press the volume up button. From this screen, use the volume down button to select wipe device case and confirm using the power button. Once the process is done, restart your device. There are many other ways of extending the battery life of your Android smartphone. The screen is the biggest battery user on phones because of its size, though the recent update causes the operating system to use most of the power. Go to your display settings. We can disable most of the features on the settings page if you don't use them. Adaptive brightness can be disabled as manually adjusting the brightness of your screen is more efficient. Ambient display wakes up your screen when you receive new notifications. I find this feature distracting and it takes its toll on the battery, which is why I normally turn it off. I never enable screensaver features because whenever my phone is charging, I'm usually asleep. Keeping the sleep interval small is also a good idea for obvious reasons. Other areas of improvement are location services and device backups. In your location settings, select battery saving to reduce the GPS pulling interval. Note that some apps require high accuracy location services, but they will simply ask you to re-enable it when the time comes. If you don't need to back up any data or you're using a third-party backup app like Dropbox, you can also safely disable Android's built-in backup to save even more battery 